Okay, here we are to talk about another review of VHS called Tombstone. So basically, I'd just like to say this was made by, let me get it right. I guess I was wrong. Why was it? It's, it's Hollywood Pictures Home Video, Synergy, and I thought it had something to do with Disney. Maybe I'm just wrong. That's what it looks like. I rewinded it. Yes, the VCR is probably the slowest way to rewind it and the worst for mechanical wise, but whatever. You're gonna need a VCR. I'm not wasting my time with a VCR rewinder because even if I do that, odds are the VCR is gonna break anyways. Okay, here's a description. A sizzling star studded cast brings to life definitely a lot of good cast members. The legendary battle to deliver justice to Tombstone, Kurt Russell backdraft turns up Turns in a gri gripping performance, griping whatever, as U.S. Marshal Wyatt Earp and Val Kimmel. Wyatt Earp was another movie they made, um, that someone made eventually, but he wasn't in it, I don't think. It's been a long time since I saw it. I saw it on HD DVD. It's only one of the only ones that worked. And Val Kimmel, The Doors. Val Kimmel was okay, but he wasn't a really huge part. Ignites the screen as outrageous dark holiday. Together they team up to bring the law to the lawlessness. And you know, you know, you know what that means. It's rated R. It's 130 minutes. That's kind of odd. You don't see a lot of movies that are just 130 minutes. Usually they're at least a little longer than that. I'm trying to see. Why did I think Disney was involved with this? Probably because, um... I'm not good with, um, yeah, Buena Vista pictures, maybe it is. Let's just say there was a Disney, um, or was, there was some kind of weird pre, there was a preview at the beginning. All I'm gonna say is, is that, so far out of the lot, and I've been watching all the VHS tapes in the lot lately, except for the one, I think it was yesterday or whenever, um, I watched one from the flea market. You, but I've been watching all the ones that I got from eBay, and they've all looked pretty good. There's been one or two duds, but other than that, it's been very good. I recommend this movie to people. Um, if you're going to watch it, obviously you're going to go for Blu-ray 4K now or even DVD. But if you have a VCR still, and you only want to spend like 4 or 5 bucks, maybe 7 bucks total, get the VC VHS tape. Um, and that's it. Bye-bye.